At 7.30, we got Western Michigan, who's 0-1, showing number two, Ohio State, who's 1-0. Ohio State favored by 38 points in the Big Ten Network. Hayden Wolf for the Broncos went 12-18, threw for 141 yards, zero touchdowns, one interception. Jalen Buckley on the ground had 16 carries for 64 yards, but two touchdowns. And Malik Tievedone, don't check, check me on how that's pronounced, had two catches for 45 yards. Will Howard for the Buckeyes went 17 to 28, threw for 228 yards, three touchdowns, zero interceptions. Trevon Henderson had eight carries for 65 yards, and Jeremiah Smith had six catches for 92 yards. And count them, two touchdowns. Ohio State went one and zero. As beat, they played Michigan, Western Michigan one time in their history, they played in 2015. Ohio State won that one, 38 to 12. At obviously the horseshoe. Um, Western Michigan didn't play poorly against Wisconsin. I will say that. Uh, I think a lot of people expected them to get their butts kicked against Wisconsin. That didn't happen, and they had a lead in the fourth quarter. Now, they let the lead slip away with dumb things that happened late in the game. Um, that's how Wisconsin ended up winning. But, number one, it was an impressive win by Wisconsin. Number two, it was honestly a pretty good game by Western Michigan. Does that mean I think they can beat Ohio State? Hell, no. This is still going to be an absolute blowout. But I will say to Western Michigan's defense... They played well last week. They just didn't come out with the win. And against a team that's as pretty, I mean, they're, they're, they're decent. Like, it's not like it's a bad team in Wisconsin. This is a pretty solid Wisconsin team. Um, they actually gave them everything they could handle that game. Uh, Western Michigan played it tight, played it close. Um, whoever scheduled Western Michigan to play Wisconsin and Ohio State in a row, I guess they really need money for their football program because just, just, wow, that that's a rough one, guys. Um it's a rough schedule. <laughs> Ohio State is a really good football team. I think Ohio State is the best team in the nation. They started out slow against Akron, as you would expect, considering it's a transfer quarterback in Will Howard, but he started to get his legs underneath him at the end of the game. And honestly, he looked pretty unstoppable. Ohio State looks like a really good team this year. I think they're the best team in the nation. If I had to pick a national champion squad now, it would be Ohio State this year. I like a lot of the pieces on their team, and I think they're going to continue to get better as the year goes along. I feel bad for Western Michigan, but they're not going to win, and they're not even going to come close. Give me Ohio State to win and cover at home.